Two ACC teams who could not have looked better last week try to keep the momentum going. I'm Jeff Fischel. This is the ACC Now, brought to you by Review Tuesday. Virginia's brutal schedule takes them on the road this week for the first time, visiting 21st-ranked BYU. But they just beat a team that was ranked 21st last week, Louisville. And Coach Mike London says his team can still get better. We're still a long ways to go because we're getting ready to play another top 25 team at BYU at their place, our first road test. But, you know, and, and going through last week's practice and the amount of effort and energy put was, that was put in it, into it, we're going to have to do the same thing again and because uh, this is, again, a really good football team. For BC, an easier next step. After steamrolling an SC team that was ninth in the nation, the Eagles now take on the main Black Bears. But Coach Steve Adazio is still worried about a letdown. With our players, I, I hope that they're mature enough to understand the lessons. All you have to do is look within our conference. With us, with USC, with other teams in our conference, and it's pretty easy to see that if you don't bring your A game, if you're not emotionally, mentally, and physically prepared every week, then you know, you take a, a really, really good, solid football team like Maine, and they'll come up here and they'll put it right on you. And that's just the way it is. Which ACC school might pull off the big upset this week? Which team is in danger of being upset? Tweet me at the ACCDN. Both BC and UVA pulled off the upsets last week, helping them make the biggest leaps in my power poll. Check it out at theacc.com. You can watch my picks, but I also wrote about the rankings, including some fun details, nuggets, and links for the teams. I'm Jeff Fischel. That is the ACC Now, brought to you by Ruby Tuesday.